if we were to look beyond what the land that is referred to in present day in, as Israel, and knowing that at various times it's been referred to by other names, depending on who uh, was governing the land, we would find that violence is not an unusual occurrence. I, I would look at violence as a choice that is not necessary. And it, you know, it's been often been referred to as an eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth, that that's the law. The law calls for uh, an equal and just return act. And uh, you know, I love the quote from, from Gandhi that you know, if everybody does an eye for an eye, eventually we'll all be blind. And you know, you just think about it like that's correct. I mean, that there's enough going on. Somebody has to have the willingness not to return the violence and negativity. The people, in particular, in, in Israel, and when you consider that if they're they're of the Jewish faith, of a Christian faith, of an Islamic faith, all claim the same father, Abraham. So what is this? This is a, a fight amongst brothers and sisters of the same family, of the same line. Certainly there are differences. And those differences, the way I look at them, are on purpose. That we all have differences, and they're not unusual. So we don't have to apologize for our differences or, or defend them. Uh, what we need to find out is how to, to get along with our differences. And it's important that in our way, each of us consider that what goes on in the world that we would at least put some light and love towards that at the very least. God Thank bless you. you. Thank you.